Hi students, this is Alex here. Exercise 5.6, question number 24. The values of m for which the line touches the hyperbola are the roots of in the equation. A plus b and a are in the equation. Now we have a general condition. That is y equal to mx plus c touches the tangent okay, to the hyperbola. Hyperbola equation is x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1. c square equal to a square m square minus b square. This condition. Now we have the hyperbola the proper formula. So we divide by 144 of big quota. We have x square by 9 minus y square by 16 equal to 1. So a square is 9 b square on the 16 and y equal to mx plus c yeah. other than the c out of value 2 root 5 so this is the substitute of the condition c square equal to 2 root 5 whole square equal to a square into m square minus 16 now, this is 2 root 5 or square. 2 root 5 into 2 root 5. This is 5. This is 4. So, 20 equal to 2 root 5 equal to 9m square minus 16. Now, 16 is 20 plus 16 equal to 9m square. Now, 9m square is 36. M of the 4. Sorry, M square into the 4. Up M under the plus or minus 2. In a root of 4. So, rend value of M cut. The values of M of the roots of this equation of the So, you can see A and B. The value of A plus B and the So, we can see in the roots 2 and minus 2 which is quadratic equation form one form. That is, this sum of the roots when the add panna 0, product of the root when the minus 4. Apo quadratic equation when the x square minus sum of the root into x plus product of the root equal to 0 one form. Apo x square is minus 0x minus 4 equal to 0. Apo total one form x square minus 4 equal to 0 that is. So, x, x order coefficient is 0. Now, x order coefficient is 0. A plus b equal to 0. Option 3.